Inside, the 2019 Ram 1500 is more refined and practical than ever before. The center console is truly massive. Ram claims it's nearly 100% larger than the competitors. The optional 12-inch infotainment display is similarly massive. The screen would give Tesla a run for its money in terms of size and resolution and is essentially twice as tall as the existing screen. There are tons of little pockets and cubbies and cup holders throughout. The packaging inside is Honda levels of good. There are 5 USB ports in the center console, 4 of which are both USB A and C. 3 of the ports talk to the latest generation of FCA's Uconnect infotainment system. When it hits showrooms later this year, the Ram 1500 can be had with one of two engines, both carryovers from the current model. The base 3.6-liter Pentasta V6 now comes standard with a 48-volt mild hybrid system FCA has branded eTorque. This system is optional on the 5.7-liter Hemi V8. On the V6, the eTorque system adds up to 90 pound-feet of torque off the line. That number jumps to 130 pound-feet on the V8. Engine output for the V6 is 305 horsepower and 269 pound-feet of torque. The Hemi makes 395 horsepower and 410 pound-feet. Both engines use an 8-speed automatic. The Echo Diesel will make a return sometime down the line and, while Ram won't confirm anything, a turbocharged inline 4 making its way under the hood is a strong possibility. There are two Borg Warner transfer cases available for four-wheel drive models. They give the truck either full-time or on-demand 4WD capabilities. There are three final drive ratios available 3.21, 3.55, and 3.92. Each one is available with a limited slip differential. Four-wheel drive models with a 3.21 or a 3.55 rear axle have an available electronic locking diff. A max tow package is available on select two-wheel drive models with a 3.92 rear end. This uses a Dana Super 60 center section, a 256mm gearset and 35 spline axle shafts.